the ugly truth about angler fish. One look at an angler fish makes you want to forget it, let alone learn seven intriguing facts about it. If you're still here, we'll discuss the world's ugliest animal. The bony anglerfish is named after its predation strategy. The anglerfish, lurefish with fleshy head growth. These fish live along the seafloor worldwide. If you see one while swimming, don't be startled by its appearance. This video will explore numerous intriguing aspects of anglerfish. What exactly is the ugly truth regarding anglerfish? Curious to know more? Now let's get deeper into this. Hello everyone, and welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update. Let's start the video. Likely, they'll soon become extinct. The El Nio weather pattern can cause aggregations of anglerfish to swim to the surface, where they are sometimes discovered floating, dead. Several varieties of anglerfish have been added to Greenpeace's red list of threatened species. Despite coming from likely unsustainable fisheries, they are widely available for human consumption. Anglerfish is popular as a food source in many countries, including Korea and Japan. However, the anglerfish's current plight makes it likely that it will become an endangered species shortly. Words fly easily from their mouths. When we describe an anglerfish's mouth as large, we don't use hyperbole. Their mouth is completely round, covering their entire skull. Small, inwardly angled teeth line the insides of both jaws. Anglerfish have terrifying fangs that can be lowered for two purposes. The first is that they are helpless to stop the meal from gliding into the anglerfish's stomach. Second, it serves to keep the food in its mouth. Okay, that is seriously creepy. The anglerfish can grow its jaw and stomach to monstrous proportions because its bones are thin and flexible. This allows the anglerfish to consume prey that is twice its body size. They can swim fast if they want to. When threatened, anglerfish may swim swiftly, but they usually drift. Due to food scarcity, these species can do this. When swimming, they can reach 0.24 body lengths per second. They also swim upside down, with their angler dangling to attract prey. They live in harmony with bacteria. If you ask me, the anglerfish's hunting light is really fascinating. So let's speak about it some more. As we've mentioned before, the bacteria that live in and around the fleshy tip utilized as baits are what produce this glow. The bacterium and the anglerfish appear to have formed a symbiotic relationship at this point, known as the esca. This is because, without a link to the anglerfish, this bacteria is unable to produce luminescence. They would need to import the chemicals required for this luminescence because they cannot produce them themselves. These microorganisms can only live in salt water, making the anglerfish's deep sea home ideal. The anglerfish's precise method for locating these germs is unknown. Parasites in the male fish population When compared to females, male anglerfish are noticeably smaller, and they don't use the same bait when hunting. They've developed into a parasitic life companion, continuously on the lookout for females to mate with. A male anglerfish will use its sharp teeth to snag a female mate, what follows is intriguing. The male begins to physically merge with the female over time. Over time, he becomes attached to her body and starts to absorb her blood and fluids, eventually causing him to bleed to death. In the end, only the testes remain of a male. Females typically carry around six males, though this number can go as high as ten in rare situations. They catch their prey with the help of bait. Anglerfish are well recognized for a specialized spine on their backs that aids in capturing prey. Like a fishing rod, this is worn by women and protrudes from their heads above their mouths. The anglerfish gets its name from its ability to catch prey with its sharp teeth. This fleshy outgrowth has a glowing tip that attracts its prey. These bacteria are what give this bait its luminescent quality. When its target is close enough, the anglerfish can devour it. Their enormous mouths allow them to consume fish nearly twice their size. This is it, everyone. So, what do you think? Leave a comment and let us know. Thank you for watching the video, and don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done that. Also, put on the notifications, because the next video is going to be a great one.